what's going on guys so in today's video we are going to be doing all the wiring um i did get an alternator for the car and it is mounted and i have a video started but with the weather i was not able to finish that video so might as well get something done because we are having a blizzard I'm going to kind of roughly get like a size that I'm going to need for the um, fuses and all that stuff out of this ABS plastic and also I'm going to measure it on my gauge cluster to see if this size would be good because then I'll order a new one. Right there is where we're going to make our line to cut and now I just have to run to the store and get all the materials. Since we're having a blizzard and there's a little bit of snow on the ground, might as well do some drifting. A little too much dirt, but let's try it. So. Oh, we're understeering like a bitch. No drifting, just understeer. Just, oh shit. No. I might be able to get it. Well, that was embarrassing. All right, let's try it onto pavement. I doubt this is gonna work. This kind of sucks. Get a blizzard and this is all the snow we get? See if we can't do a burnout. Okay. Well, we got some smoke, but that's about it. That sucks. Sucks we can't even have fun. Okay. Or did a little burnout. Holy fuck, that's deep right there. Well, that's all the four eights got. So here we have the fuse block. It has a pretty nice, you know, cover that goes on it. Now this little screws that I got, they don't work. They don't fit in there. So what we're gonna do is drill the holes where we want them to be, which is gonna be like somewhere like right here. And obviously we have this whole ABS plastic. It's not gonna be this big. I just needed to like have the height of it so we can cut cut and trim what we need to. So the relays are, this cross block, I think I might put it right here. That way we'll have room to run the wires on the other side. And then the relays, we're gonna put like back here. So I'm gonna start drilling the holes. That way I can start mounting the relays. Let's see if these even work. 
and they do sort of okay so this is how it's gonna be mounted obviously we can cut all of this off because that's gonna be excess um, so essentially what happens is on this type of relay the white power is the positive black wire is the ground red wire goes to the fuse and the blue wire goes out to the fan or anything like that I also have another relay uh, I'm not gonna put that on right now because I can't think of anything to use it with don't mind the background music but um yeah I'm gonna finish this up okay so if I knew half of what I was doing I would have done this a little differently but red one goes to fuse 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 you know one two three four five so the red one goes to the fuse box black one is the ground the blue one is the power and the white one is the activation switch so essentially that's how I'm gonna have them ran all the way down it's gonna go blue blue wire blue 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 white wire which is a switch white 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 so that's essentially what it's gonna be and it's gonna be like fan, um, fuel pump. I don't know. I'll figure the rest out. But anyways, that's how it's gonna be. So now I just have to go get some crimpers so I can start on all that. So this is what it's starting to look like right now. We got all the fuses. Yes, I know. Anyways, we have power running I gotta finish up the other two got the wires trimmed already they have to go down then I have to do the white ones so I'm actually just gonna um get connectors on these two and then I'll put you on like a time lapse or something I can yeah Or project, I should say. So, I mean, I could have cleaned it up a little bit better, but first time I've ever done it. So, obviously, our, yeah, so pretty much power is going to go right to here. It's going to power this fuse block, which is going to power these relays. White wires are the switches. So this won't see any power until we hit that switch. Hit that switch, it's gonna re release the power to the blue wire, which is gonna run out this side, which is gonna run to fuel pump or to whatever that runs. These are all the grounds. So I'm gonna put like a little ring connector on there and every single one so I can ground it all to a you know single location so everything will work as it should so there we go once the snow quits and it starts warming up and stuff we're gonna figure out a spot to mount this and we're gonna start hooking everything up making sure everything works like I said I started the video on the alternator and yeah I just have to wait until I can get to like a junk card and I'm pretty much I'm missing the four pin connector I can get that then I can start running some wire um, but yeah, that's going to be it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If this is your first time, subscribe. Um, I noticed I got a couple more subscribers this month. So uh, if you haven't checked out any of the other videos, check the videos out.